Hi, I'm David Salmon, horticulturist. We're going to be talking about ornamental grasses. Ornamental grasses are some of the most important plants that we can include in our landscapes for a number of reasons. Their beauty, ease of care, longevity, and just overall contribution to the habitat garden. But unfortunately, many people, while they're interested in using them and plant them in their gardens, aren't familiar with proper maintenance on ornamental grasses. It's not difficult, but there are a few basics that are particularly helpful to keep your grasses looking good. The key thing to remember is that grasses need to be cut back at the start of spring. Now here's a, a, an example of a grass that has not been maintained properly. Grasses don't normally have this much dead foliage left from the previous year's growth. On smaller to medium sized grasses, you want to take, you want to cut them back about to the level of my hand, three to four inches. Cut it all the way across. The second thing is grasses mature in age, the clump spreads. And oftentimes you get some die out in the center of the grass. As you can see, the living part of this particular grass seems to be around the perimeter. So what needs to happen in addition to cutting it low, get your gloves, get in there, scratch it out, pull it out. You don't need this in the middle of the grass because all that does is suppress the growth coming up from the center. The other thing I want to remind people is that while grasses are not heavy feeders, they do appreciate some nitrogen applied in the fall. Grasses are very soil dependent and in fact I recommend that you use mycorrhizal inoculants when you plant grasses, but grasses are highly dependent on their soil and the mycorrhizal, the fungal association between root and soil. So inoculate, fertilize in the fall. You want to feed the soil to feed your grass. Now here's an example of a Chinese maidenhair grass, Miscanthus, that has been properly cut back to approximately six inches, scratched out, and the results as the grass begins to grow, nice and full in the middle, good growth around the edges of the plant. This ornamental grass is good to go and it's going to be just beautiful this year and make a valuable contribution to the landscape.